Welcome to Chasing Dory Explore Operation Tutorial Video. The packing box includes Chasing Dory Explore Drone, Boy, Winder with Buoyancy Cable, Bluetooth Remote Controller, Remote Controller Stand, Metal Detector, Net, Micro USB Cable, Power Adapter. Install the Remote Controller Stand. First, remove the M5 Asterisk Gate Screw from the bottom of the Remote Controller. Align the support rod bottom with the remote controller slot. Insert and tighten the M5 asterisk gate screw. Then remove the nut from the back of the phone tablet stand. Clip the top of the mount onto the stand and tighten the nut. After inserting your phone tablet, the remote controller assembly is complete. Connect the ROV, buoy and reel. Pull out the cable from both ends of the winder and plug them into the ROV and buoy ports respectively. Tighten the nuts clockwise. After connection, Dory Explorer will power on automatically. Upon successful startup, the two LED lights on the ROV and buoy will illuminate, accompanied by two self-test sounds. Metal detector start up a shutdown. After installing the battery, long press the metal detector power button. The detector's red light will flash twice with a brief beep sound, indicating successful power on. Long press the power button again, and the red light will flash once with a longer beep sound indicating the metal detector has been turned off. App Download Scan the on-screen QR code to download the Chasing GoTo app. Or visit iOS App Store or Google Play to download. Connect to ROV Wi-Fi. When Dory Explorer is powered on, go to your phone tablet's Wi-Fi settings. Enter the password 1234-5678 to connect to the Wi-Fi network, beginning with Dory. This completes the Wi-Fi connection to the ROV. App Connection Turn on your phone's Bluetooth and the controller switch. Open the Chasing GoTo app. Allow Bluetooth permissions. The app will automatically display the controller Bluetooth connection interface. Select the controller name and click to select. When connected successfully, the controller's Bluetooth indicator light will remain solid. Please calibrate the drone according to the calibration instructions in the app before each use. Water Entry Preparation First, long press the metal detector's power button to activate it. Second, place the connected Dory Explorer in water and open the Chasing GoTo app. Click Start. Finally, press the Unlock Motors button on the Bluetooth controller to unlock the propellers. The drone can now be operated normally via the remote control. The Unlock button is located at the top right of the controller. Click to unlock lock the device. Use the left joystick to control movement direction. The right joystick to control ascending descending. The left bottom wheel to control lights. The right bottom wheel to control pitch angle. The top left button to switch shooting modes photo or video. And the top right button for shooting, recording control. You can also control the drone directly through the mobile app. After clicking the unlock button at the bottom of the screen, you can use the virtual joysticks on screen instead of the controller joysticks. Specific operation instructions are shown in the video. Dual User Mode Operation Connect another phone to the app in the same way and click Start to enable dual user operation. Please note that the primary control device can control all product functions, while secondary control devices can only control photo or video recording functions. Metal Detector Guide When the metal detector approaches metal objects, the detector's red light will flash. At this time, you can see the metal detector's flashing red light on your phone screen indicating that the targeted metal object has been successfully detected. After recording, click Media at the bottom of the app main interface. Select the photos or videos you want to download. Click the Download icon, and the photos or videos will be saved directly to your phone tablet's album. Charging Instructions Choose the appropriate power plug and assemble it to the charger. Then connect it to the drone to begin charging. The power adapter indicator shows red light during normal charging and green light when charging is complete. Insert the included 5 volts USB charging cable into the remote controller port to charge the controller. During charging, the Bluetooth indicator light will continuously flash, and the battery indicator will display the current power level. Please note that the buoy does not need charging. After charging is complete, please promptly unplug the adapter. Above is the Chasing Dory Explore tutorial video. We wish you a pleasant exploration and discovery underwater.